Hey guys, what's up? Flano123 here. Today I'm going to be showing you a, a little trick I've been using for the past year-ish. Um, have you ever, like, had a lot of ore to prospect or a lot of greens to disenchant? Well, I do on a daily basis. So, uh, this trick is pretty much showing you how you can, or, like, it's, it's how you can easily prospect all of that ore and disenchant all of those greens or whatever. Uh, while well, you can go AFK, uh, it is using a third-party program, but uh, if you get in trouble, I would just say, dude, I had to disenchant 100 greens. Do you really want me to single-click all those? Yes, there's macros, but um, yeah. So first thing you need to do is go to Google, type in mouse machine, and you can download that from Softpedia. First one that comes up, download that. And then, I don't care, Norton, I do not have any warnings, I use AVG, lol. Um, then, yes, I have a lot of outdated add-ons, I don't care, they work, so whatever. Um, you want to download Panda, P-A-N-D-A, -A, up to date, yes. Download that, that simple. Log into WoW. I have mouse machine, yes. Here's mouse machine. It's pretty simple. Don't want any sound. And I don't normally play in windowed mode. I play in windowed mode. Ah, windowed mo mode full screen. I like this. Perhaps just didn't like when I uh, full size it when I'm like showing my desktop, whatever. Okay, so here I am in game. I'm gonna type slash panda and then hit the mouse machine. So, prospecting, I have a stack of pyrite ore. So, prospect. Here's the list. So, you would hover over where you need to be. It's better to do this in window mode or have it on your other monitor, probably window mode, uh, full screen, whatever. Um, hover over a pirate or it will say eight or two eight two. So two eight two and then it was two sixty. That's pretty much the coordinates of the port. Left button click and for prospecting I do four. Disenchanting you do five depending on your leg start prospect it and it'll pretty much just go straight through your whole entire uh, thing never set it to one uh, seconds because you will never be able to stop it you'll have to restart your computer or do something I had to shut down and restart uh, two seconds is kind of cutting close but it's not really a big deal because it was like one two so you have time but just one second is just so quick uh, with the rings, it's gonna be the same. Like, I just go in here. See, 141 Jasper rings. Yes, I make any kind of ring for Kata. I don't really uh, transmute them since I don't have an alchemist on Illidan, which I am now. Or, which I, or where I am now. So, uh, just finish up making five more rings. Pretty much you just go straight through and uh, make all your rings and slash panda and mouse machine set up. And disenchant. Nah. See, that's what I mean. That's what you'd have to do. The coordinates for disenchanting is a bit different. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, 248. Five seconds for disenchanting. Now click your screen every five seconds. So um, yeah, pretty much like this is how you want to. Um, it's the easiest way I found uh, without using an actual bot that makes rings and disenchants them for you. I mean, this actually takes somewhat work making rings and figuring out know, the coordinates. I mean, obviously being kind of lazy, but uh, it's better than having to make a macro and click it every whatever five seconds 
or four seconds, whatever it is. So uh, if you found this video helpful, please be sure to like and favorite the video as well as subscribe to my account. Uh, I'll be making more videos like this in the near future. So yeah, thanks for watching, guys.